you. How many innocent lives did you take to get here? It's time to put an end to this. I would be impressed if I wasn't so tired of all this. This time, you're alone. You can't harm me. None of your kind can. I forbid you to come any closer. My faith is my shield. To be able to turn us away like that, that's a rare gift for a mortal. Some of us don't even believe it's possible. You have failed. Not yet. You're not infallible. As long as I have God on my side, I will be. I'll break you. You and your faith. A touch of bravado. Now that you're cornered, nothing can stop us. You're done for. We won't disappear without a fight. The war is already won. We've proven we're much more powerful than you. You took us by surprise. But now we've been warned. The battle will be long. Resistant. Like cockroaches. Unlike you, we have all of eternity before us. Your pitiful efforts to reach me won't change a thing. What's your plan here? To put a stop to you. By killing me. We are Legion. Killing one of us won't make the rest of us vanish into thin air. I beg to differ. You are the cornerstone of this operation. If you were to disappear, the Society of St. Leopold would withdraw. We're not the only ones committed to this fight. If you truly trust them, then why take over control here? They needed guidance. You should never have exposed yourself. The Inquisition of Boston will die with you. No one will continue your fight. All of this energy wasted. Why? I have seen the consequences of your crimes. I have dried orphans' tears, tended to gaping wounds, calmed tormented minds. You spread your plague like rats. You feed off the human race. You're nothing but parasites! At least I don't deny my true nature. I know what I am. A creature superior to you mortals. But we're not just talking about humans here. You profane the very Earth with your presence. From the shadows, you manipulate the fates of civilizations. You bring famines. You stoke wars. You seek to take control of the entire world. And you'll be the cause of its ruin. What about you? You live in secrecy. You lie to those you feign to protect. No government dares stand up to you. But we're doing nothing more than defending them. For now. But that's how tyrants are born. You're no better than us. I smell nothing but destruction in your wake. What would you have me do? Faced with a creature stripped of all emotion who sees you as nothing more than cattle. I've lost count of the number of dead bodies and broken lives. Fire is the only path to redemption, down to the very last. That may be what you believe, but there are others who disagree. What? The head of the SAD thinks he can use us to his advantage. And he's not the only one. 
Like so many terrorists moved like pawns on a geopolitical chessboard. I will never let that happen. It's above your pay grade, and you know it. I must try. In the end, only one question remains. Why do you continue to fight when the outcome is already decided? Your demise is inevitable. Why do you refuse to accept it? You can struggle. It's the natural order of things. The fight will only heighten my primal instincts. No creature can resist the Almighty. I am here for only one thing. I am a monster. Your predator. That's impossible. You're my prey. A sheep that has become separated from his flock. I'm hunting you. I'm going to show you the price you must pay if you come after me. This is impossible. Now, you will die. Stay back! Deus, Deus. Why do you... Richard, what are you doing here? Hazel sent me. I'll take over from here. She planned for everything. Best you best go back to see her. What do we do about him? I'll take, I'll take care of him. Tell her, Tell her the SI is under is control. Under control. Good work, Caleb. Stanford is dead. Do you think that will be enough? Others will come to hunt us. We must be ready. Like prey who have discovered their power. They know they'll be devoured if they lay down their weapons. So it'll never be over then. We are partly to blame for this. You're defending them? No, but I understand them. Stanford wasn't fighting for his life. He was fighting to save his kind. Like you. I was just following orders. Do you think this is the end of Boston? Like I said, we've won a reprieve. We must use this time to adapt. Disappear. That's up to the prince to decide, not me. 